If you're like me, you're probably wondering, how am I related to this individual? Keep watching. Every single weekend warrior in pressure washing, all the guys out there in the ether who are doing this gig as a part-time income, some of them eventually decide they want to go full-time. They run into phase one of the local domination system of lean and mean. They start mobilizing. They start getting gear that is better than hobby gear. They start loading up their trailer. They start finding chemical supply places to where they can replenish their bleach and all the chemicals that they need. And inevitably, they start dreaming about the ultimate pressure washing shop. I'm gonna show it to you. What's up guys? I am Aaron Parker. Welcome back to the Lean and Mean Academy where we talk about one truck, big profits, baby. All right, so I want you to imagine that you've been in business for a little while. You finally are in that phase three and I'll put a video uh, up here in the corner somewhere about the, the, the three phases of a lean and mean business. You can check that out if you want because you may not know what I'm talking about. But I want you to imagine you're in phase three and you finally got the budget to build the ultimate pressure washing shop. Well, today I am on site here at Soft Washers HQ down here in Alabama and he has built the ultimate shop. Now, today I've got four points for you, okay? One, two, three, four. And here's the thing. I have had, I listed about 10 or 12 different really awesome things about this shop, but I've narrowed it down to four for time's sake. Hey, but before we get into this, okay, if you're looking to take your business to the next level in 2022, right? You're looking to launch a pressure washing business. You're brand new. You're wanting to go from zero to $7,000 a month. I urge you to click the first link in the description, first link in the comments. It'll take you to the local domination course. This course has got thousands of guys and gals started in their pressure washing business and up to that 7K mark consistently it lays it all out it's a business course it's going to show you chemical knowledge it's going to show you a bunch of different things and it has had rave reviews over the course of the last year we were very proud of it so if you're interested click the link in the description first link in the comments all right so let's take a look at this aerial view of this shop now this shop is 100 by 60 plenty of room and let me give you a tip if you're going to be building a shop you always want to build bigger than what you think. Pierce did this very well. He added a 100 by 60 shot with a 40 by 40 pad on the back so he could wash any trucks or any trucks that were leaking oil or leaking SH. It didn't get all over his shop. That back pad is gonna eventually be covered and it's going to provide kind of a lean-to situation for more storage. But this is really huge. Have enough room to keep everything that you need. It sounds kind of simple, kind of stupid, but most people just build too small. So the first one, the first point is build big, right? This place could hold eight trucks, four in a line, all the way down, 100 foot. You could fit pretty much eight trucks. I mean, you could fit more in here, but you just would take up some of your, your storage space. So that is number one. This thing is big enough to go the full length of his business on how far he wants to build, right? He wants to scale it even bigger, he can do it. Let's go to number two. All right, so second in line here, number two is the battery bank. Now, the reason this is so important, everything we do has to use a 12 volt. Our trucks, our, our pressure washers, our 12 volt systems, Pierce loves 12 volt, right? Everything runs off a 12 volt battery and he has trickle chargers and that's why the ultimate pressure washing shop is gonna have a battery bank. Hey Pete, tell me why you got so many batteries, dude. They all go bad. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Cause I got employees. <laughs> Third in line here for the ultimate pressure washing shop is the Zamboni. Why do I call it a Zamboni? Because I remember the Zamboni on D2, the Mighty Ducks, and I've always wanted to drive one. But if you have an epoxy floor, you need something to clean it. How are you going to keep these beautiful epoxy floors clean? Frankly, I don't know anyone else who has one in their pressure washing shop, and that's why it made the ultimate list. 
Fourth and final on this list to keep this quick is the ultimate bleach tank. Take a look at this massive tank right here. Listen, what's the biggest thing guys can complain about? All right, chemical costs, right? Having to go pick up Kim. The ultimate pressure washing shop will have an on-site bleach tank. So I wanted to include a couple of these other creature comforts and accoutrements to the ultimate pressure washing shop. These things, the guys love to play them. Come in here in the morning, maybe get around and go back out to work. They love the ping pong. We actually love the bubble hockey. I'm really good at that. Also, we got a microwave and we've got a, an ability to do laundry, not including you know storage for surface cleaners, ladders, extra motors, extra hose reels, extra everything. Pierce is one of those guys that one is none, two is one, right? Also, what if you need to pull a skid out of a truck? Well, got a forklift too. This concludes the ultimate pressure washing shop. But listen, we have an event coming up, the core four, Mike Vidan, Justin Rogers, Cody Yarbrough, and myself have WashCon Live. And it's the number one pressure washing event on earth. It's gonna be two days, three days if you're VIP, of learning of everything that you need to know to launch your business into 2022. It's a live event. Check out the tickets, get your ticket now. Do not miss it. Link is in the description, link in the comments. Okay, so that concludes this video of the Ultimate Pressure Washing Shop, all right? I mentioned a few things here. There's a bunch more things that make this really awesome as far as location. We got a gate. It's protected. It's locked. We got LED lighting, and we also got, you know, everything is just locked up and safe. That's another thing that a lot of guys have issues with when they first start, right? So this is something to aspire to. If you're brand new, I know you can do it. I hope you do it. I want to help you do it. Get your tickets to WashCon. Click the link below. I'll see you guys in the next video. If you want to win this $28,000 pressure washing trailer, click the link below. We're going to be giving away this custom built trailer as well as over $15,000 in door prizes at WashCon Live. There's only 100 tickets available for this event and it's being held on February 11th and 12th in Nashville, Tennessee at the Standard Club. The four biggest names in the pressure washing industry will be speaking live. Cody Yarbrough from Southeast Softwash, Mike Vidan from All About Pressure Washing, Aaron Parker from Aaron's Lean Mean Academy, and Justin Rogers from Forever Self Employed. The core four have come together to bring the most immersive two day training event in the history of the industry. Covering everything from marketing sales equipment and long-term growth and if that wasn't enough we're also offering a few tickets for the third day that we're calling the vip roundtable where we're going to work with you in small groups to break down your business and build a personal game plan specific to you do not wait this event will sell out there's less than 80 seats left and even fewer vip roundtable spots so click the link below and get your tickets before it's too late